back to that weather because there is still rain on the way. And here's That's Dallas. right, David, and uh, friends out in Moreno Valley have had over 20 inches of rain so far this season. We have the time lapse going for you out of Long Beach today for the sunset, and it was lovely down there. A few scattered clouds across Long Beach. They had highs today in the low to mid 60s. And right now we take a look at the live Megadopoli. We're all clear, but a winter weather advisory starts tomorrow afternoon for all of the mountains of Southern California. This is not a big snow event, but it will produce some snow in hazardous driving conditions if you're headed up to the mountain areas above 6,000 feet. 66 degrees today. 66 is normal. And there's the rainfall downtown. 18.27 inches. That's way above the 14 and a half, 15 that we averaged. So this year is going to be above normal and we have more coming. Take a look at the satellite view tonight. A good looking area of low pressure is forming here over the ocean out to the west. Let's find out where we are. There's Los Angeles right there. There's a band of rain associated with a cold front. So the winds are coming up out of the southeast and that cold front can be seen beautifully here on the satellite image. The whole weather system is moving in our direction. Oh, right along the front, there's some nice lifting of the air. There's a slight chance of a thunderstorm as this moves in our direction tomorrow afternoon. So just be prepared for that because it's going to be a dramatic change from today. So we go into time. There's the front making its way along the central coastline about 10 o'clock tomorrow morning. For us, no real problems. A nice marine layer, though, coming in over the air. It could be some drizzle early in the morning. But the main band of rain doesn't move into Ventura and L.A. counties until the afternoon hours, but once it gets here, it is going to rain with a chance of a thunderstorm just as the center of the low passes right over us at night. That's when the temperatures at about 20,000 feet are very cold, so thermodynamically that allows the air to rise up, and when that happens, Boom, thunderstorms can rumble. Here's my rainfall total as I'm forecasting with this weather system. Check out your location. If you're out at Riverside, this goes all the way through Thursday, 7,300s there. Down at San Clemente, about a half an inch of rain. Downtown the same. Along these uh, mountain slopes here in the foothills, we could see very close to an inch of rain in that area over the next 24 to 36 hour period. Here's the temperature forecast for tonight. Another cool night. Clouds do roll in across the area. 33 in the mountain areas in the high desert tonight. About 38 and up in uh, Palm Springs about 50. Tomorrow a lot of clouds, rain in the afternoon hours. And you can see that coming down in Glendale, Inglewood. Please drive carefully. If you can get most of your action done uh, for tomorrow morning would be best because during the afternoon, it's going to be wet across L.A. A slight chance of thunder, about a half an inch downtown. That's my forecast. Then on Thursday, showers will be ending during the late morning, early afternoon, maybe a little afternoon sunshine. Then that sets us up for really nice weather. Look at Friday, Saturday, and Oscar Sunday. 70 degrees. Looks good, doesn't it? On Friday and Saturday and Sunday, Oscar Sunday, some scattered clouds around and a high of 69. Rainfall totals in the valleys, as I mentioned, anywhere between three quarters and an inch of rain. If you're right up against those foothill communities, you could get a little bit more. And if a thunderstorm rolls over, you know that can produce brief heavy rain. In the beaches tomorrow, cloudy rain in the afternoon and then showers diminishing on Thursday, leading us to sunshine. Newport Beach on Saturday. Boy, I like that. 64. How about those mountain forecasts? Drive carefully, carry the chains at 6,000 feet. There will be snow to one to two, maybe three to four inches of snow. Everything starts ending by Friday, and the weekend at Big Bear Lake will be nice, 51 and 52 for afternoon highs. In the desert, scattered showers tomorrow afternoon into Thursday morning, and then a beautiful weekend. David, this storm system is going to hit fairly quickly and give us some rain and some snow. I'll update that tonight at 11. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.